A complete stranger knocks on your door and asks you if they can cook you dinner in your home. Do you say no, fearful that this person has bad intentions, or would you say yes, being open to making a new connection with a friendly stranger? Well, today we're in Mexico and we're gonna be asking people that very question because we believe that the most fulfilling life is a life full of genuine connections. And we actually did this once before in our town of Vancouver and met the most incredible couple. And now we wanna see if it's possible to do it here. The problem is this time we're in a Spanish speaking country and my Spanish is, well, yo soy, uh, I, hmm. Yeah, it's horrendous. So with our only help being Google Translate and the basic Spanish that I've learned so far, we're off to knock on some doors. I can't even fit in the door. Oh boy. Soy de Canada. Um, estamos trabajando en un proyecto. Mi, mi nombre es uh, Brad. Um, estamos trabajando en un proyecto para un video en el que intentamos hacer una conexión significativa um, con extraños en México y no uh, nos pregunta vamos si podríamos prepararles uh, prepararles a uh, la cena esta noche um, um, estarías interesado no okay okay gracias adiós first no all right here we go oh boy oh boy why does it have to make so much noise oh there's dogs oh boy oh man this is so terrible. Hola, hola, hola. Mi nombre es Brad. Estamos trabajando en un proyecto para video y nos pregunta vamos si podríamos prepararles la cena esta noche. Um, esta noche. Esta noche. En, en, en tu casa. Ah, ok. Lo que pasa es que nosotros vamos a salir. ¿A salir? Sí. Um, o sea, estamos por salir. Salir. Ah, uh, to, to leave. Ah, sí, ok. Ok, gracias. Uh, cocinar, uh, cenar por, por tú esta noche. <laughs> no, no? Ok, gracias. Gracias. Uh, adios. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a difficult one. It's already nerve wracking enough when I'm knocking on strangers' doors asking to cook them dinner in their home, but then when I don't know how to communicate, my whole body just shuts down. I think you should try one. I can't speak. That's exactly why you should try it. Try at least like read the script. Yeah. Estamos trabajando en un proyecto. Una para para. I can't. I can't. You gotta try. Go. You gotta try. They won't understand That's what okay. I'm saying. You gotta try. I, I need to go off script. How are you gonna go off script when you I don't can't... know any of the language? What are you gonna go off script with? Sign language? On like Google Translate. Being like, hey, I'm Brooke. I'm <laughs> from Australia, and I want to cook dinner in your home tonight. Basics. Hola, me llamo Brooke. Uh, soy de Canada. Um, it's on there. Video project. Um, es como cocina la cena en tu casa esta noche. <laughs> <laughs> podríamos, um, uh, podríamos sen oh, cenar. Podríamos uh, cenar por, por tú. No. 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 Yo trabajo en la noche. I'm not doing that again. Well, it's safe to say we butchered that one. So far, it seems like even with Google Translate, people have no idea what we're talking about. But we were convinced that even with our terrible Spanish, someone has to be open to two gringos coming and cooking them dinner tonight. So we kept on going. I don't know where the doorbell is. Hello? Hola? Tócale, <laughs> Uh, si sí, podríamos prepar, uh, prepararles la cena esta noche por tú. Necesitas cocina. Sí. ¿Dónde preparar? Uh, we, oh, okay. uh, um, we, me. Yeah, ella cocinar sí. por tú. Pero acá. Sí, en tu casa. Uh -huh. ¿Cuántos son? ¿Cuántos son? ¿Cuántas personas? ¿Nada más dos? Sí, sí. ¿Cuántas uh, personas? Uh, <laughs> 
Muchas. 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 Eleven. Once personas aquí. Ay. Ok. We can, We can make it work. Esta noche. Cena. Hoy. Ah, va a ser como hoy. una cena hoy en la noche. Sí. Ah. Va a haber un evento acá. Va a haber un evento. Evento. Oh, sí. Aquí. Sí. Uh, diferente noche. No hay evento. Sí. Sí. Yeah. Sí. 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 Yeah. Sí. Ok. Sí. sí. Bueno. Bueno. <risa> bueno. Gracias. Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mucho gusto. En mi house cubre bocas. Ah, sí. 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 Adiós. Bye. All right. Well, we found. Our family. 11. 11. We have to go back to Walmart. <laughs> Or we just do risotto and some like side and do some apples and everyone can have a bit of risotto. I have no idea how to cook, so you're going to tell me what to do. I know what I'm going to do. Yeah? I know what I'm going to do. All right. There's a, a lot of food. It's a lot of people. <laughs> kind of nervous for this one. Best part about doing an experience like this is that we get to connect with new people, but I can really only get by with like super, super basic Spanish. And there's gonna be 11 people to talk to. I think it's gonna go well. They seem like really lovely, friendly people. To like just open a door to two random Canadians that don't speak Spanish. Like, and have us with their family of 11 people. 11 people, they're gonna be pretty cool people. Hola. Oh, she's so dressed up and beautiful. ¿Cómo está? Para servirles. <laughs> Am I here? Gracias. Gracias. Oh, wow. Wow. Hola. Hello. Vete por ahí, Bruna. <laughs> oh. More perros. Hola. Oh. This is great. Gracias. All right, this is our space for cooking. Sí. Perfect. Yeah. Brooke, sí. Bro. Carla. 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 Hola. Brad. Me llamo Brad. Brad. My name is Chaiti. Mucho gusto. Eh, ¿Y tú? Hola, Sarai. My children. Sarai. We super in Londres. Sí. <laughs> From family. Sí, sí. <laughs> Ella es, uh, va, vas a cocinar uh, risotto italiano. Oh, italiano. ¿Pero ya ves? Sí, perfecto. Uh, sí. Ah, okay. Sí, gracias. Um, what? Ah, cuchillo, tabla. Cuchillo, tabla. Universal language is like dictionary. Yeah. Ooh, gracias. <laughs> It's interesting to see that even in a completely different culture and country, we have simple things like offering an apron to cook with that connect us. But the language difference, on the other hand, was making it a bit difficult to connect. Uh, estudiante? Sí. Sí? Um, ¿Cómo estudiar? Oh, ¿cómo, ¿Cómo es? No, 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 ¿cómo es? Uh, um, ¿Qué estudié? Cut. Just dice. Yeah, uh, just... Or just a little, like... Um... 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 Expensive or...? Um... Um... Vivamos. Um... Um... Uh, how do I say? <laughs> At this point, I really wish I had signed up for that Spanish class in high school because this conversation would have gone a lot easier if I had it. Unfortunately though, I can't go back in time, but what I can do is I can start now, which is why over a month ago, I started learning Spanish with Lingoda, which is an online language learning platform where you can learn English, German, French, or Spanish with native speaking teachers from all around the world, which allows them to have classes 24 seven. And that has been super helpful for me since I'm currently traveling. So as long as I have an internet connection, I can take a class anywhere on the go and anytime that fits my schedule. Lingoda is great because you can actually choose what you want to learn. So since I'm in a Spanish speaking country right now, I can actually join these online classes learn about grammar, and then take what I've learned and actually go and practice it with the locals. And if you're not currently traveling like I am, you're still able to practice your speaking in the classes with actual people. Learning a new language has genuinely opened up the world and connection to me in a way that I could never have imagined. So if you're looking to learn a new language right now, Lingoda actually has this really awesome challenge where if you sign up for one of their sprint challenges and you attend every single class, you can actually get 50% or 100% of your money back. So if you're interested, Join with the link in the description to get $25 off your challenge, and maybe I'll see you in one of the group classes. All right, back to the video. Just as we were starting to get worried that this dinner might not go too well with us not understanding each other, Alejandro arrived, but he wasn't alone. Hola! Hola, Hola. Hola. Mucho gusto. Oh, oh, how are you? Are you, <laughs> are you cooking? Si, si, si. Uh, she's a chef. Uh, she, uh, you, what is your option here? I, uh, I have to film. Use, uh, you, you film. Circa de... Si, si. Sobre, um, conexión humana. 
Ah, ok. You have a connection. You're Mexican. Oaxaca, Mexican. Sí, sí, oh. sí. I speak uh, just a little bit English. If you want to speak with me, just write. Necesito <laughs> practicar mi español. Español. I speak. I need to practice my English. Now we're okay, going okay. to. Yeah, we'll go, go back and forth. <laughs> yeah. What is your name? My name is Eliese. She's my wife. Hola, mucho gusto. Lo contratamos para que viniera. Hmm. What was that? What? <laughs> Hey. You invite me because they don't understand what you say in English. So they they invited you so that you could help them understand us. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> all right, we got all the cooking going on. I'm getting distracted in conversation over here, and you guys are doing all the hard work. What do we got going on, Brooke? I'm sauteing the onion, and then I'm well, going like, to wait for the chicken bones, and then I'm going to transfer all of that. What do we got here? Zucchini. Broccoli, green beans. Mexico, ejote. 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 So this is a really cool technique that I learned. You put salt on the garlic that you've chopped, and then you use the back of your knife, and you grind it with the salt into a garlic paste. Well, while Brooke was working hard cooking all the food, I had my own hard work to do. Oh boy, the mezcal is starting. The mezcal, if you go had a, a principal home like this, you need to drink a shot of mezcal. Si, sí, si. Sí. It's the basic needed. Yeah, it's, okay. it's a custom. Yeah. yeah. Alargo el brazo, cojo el codo, y me lo tomo todo. Y me, oh. <laughs> In English, cheer. Cheers. Yeah. Salud. Salud. En español. En español. Salud. 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 How long? How do how you think he here in Oaxaca? Five more days. Okay. Yes, I hear. Yes. She said yes. That's crazy. We we we've been here for an hour, an hour maybe, and they're already saying that we can stay at their house. And that is your, the principal mean is your channel, the si, si. connection people. That si. now what what is the result here now? Exactly. You go from so easily. You can go from strangers to friends. Yeah, this is a result. Yeah. Okay, yeah. hey, come on. See ya. Salud. So now I'm adding all of the chicken and onions back to the risotto. So don't let me go I'm all up in I love Where do we go Just let me know. I'm saying. Can you dance? I'm terrible. Nah. Can you teach me? What? My he... wife? We're gonna dance? Oh, we're about to eat? Si. <laughs> Let's go. Oh wow, this is beautiful. This house is just so beautiful. I can't believe we're here right now. We are literally in the middle of Mexico and we're having dinner with this incredible family. How do you feel? Amazing. This is wild. This is so good. It's just crazy that like all this happened, we could have just been at home. But like here. you're on holiday and you're yeah. just going around the neighborhood knocking on the strangers' like, doors. Most tourists would never have this experience because they would just be going to the bars, they would be going to like the tourist spots, but we just wanted to connect. And now look where we are. Wow. Babe, this looks so good. I'm excited. We're about to eat some good food here. I hope they all enjoy it. Um, el objetivo de este proyecto es inspirar a las personas a conectarse más entre sí. Hay tanto miedo en el mundo que impide que las personas se conecten. Entonces, gracias por invitarnos a su casa y dejarnos cocinar su cena. Gracias a ustedes. Gracias. Y está en su casa cuando gusten. Gracias. Gracias. Close with a drink. Estiro brazo extendido. Oh my God. <laughs> Estiro el brazo. Estiro el brazo. Encojo el codo. Encojo el codo. Y me lo, y me lo tomo todo. Y me lo tomo todo. Bravo, baby. Bien, everybody, dig in. <laughs> Oh, 
Gracias. Salud. Yeah. As we began to clean up, I realized I had forgot that I was in a completely different country. But this family brought two random tourists into their space and made us truly feel like we were at home. Todos ustedes son tan amigables. Thank you. Sí. Extraños ahora now amigos y family. <laughs> ustedes son mi familia. Family. That's not the first time that I've heard that sentiment from a stranger. You're family now, so we're all doing it together. It never ceases to amaze me how deep the connections you can make with complete strangers in such little time, and all the excuses I've used in the past to why I can't connect with people. Ustedes no entienden el español. Nosotros no entendemos el inglés. Mucha este sí, sí. confusión. Sí, sí. Pero todavía podemos hacer una gran conexión. Conexión. Sí. ¿Sí? Gracias por no. invitarnos en tu casa. Bienvenidos. Las veces que guste. If there's anything to take away from this video, I hope it inspires you to turn off your computer, put down your phone, and get out into the real world and discover some new connections. Because the world could use a lot more connection right now. Adios. Yes. Adios. <laughs>